Good morning, everybody. This is Dr. Palacios, and I am here to answer another health question regarding migraines today. So the question comes from a quote from a forum that says, my headaches just won't go away, which obviously brings us to the question, why won't my migraines ever go away? So obviously it's a simple question, but the answer is, a little bit more complex because we need to look at both scenarios. So the scenario of like, will my migraine go away right now in this attack? Or are we talking about the long-term effects? Are, are my migraines going to stay like this for the rest of my life? So I do wanna tackle both sides. And I'm pretty sure the person who wrote this meant long-term effects, but I do want to consider the short-term, like a migraine attack that happens now. So first of all, everything goes away. Nothing stays permanent, but the severities does change. And when it comes to short-term migraine attacks, we need to keep in mind that a migraine is on average between four to 72 hours. On a study of in John Hopkins, uh, on a survey of about 1,100 migraine sufferers, it was found that 44% of adults had about 24 hours of migraine attacks. That's pretty long. Also 72 hours, it's actually pretty long too. The range, your range, if you're somebody who suffers from migraines, your range is gonna be a little bit different than perhaps the four to 72 hours. Maybe it's a little less or maybe it could be more, but you, by this point, you may have figured out what your range is. Now, if a migraine lasts unusually longer than your normal range, it's, I should probably consider uh, getting to seek help as soon as possible because this could be something else that could be linked to a worse attack and you never want to wait or stay silent about that. And you definitely want to let your doctor once that's resolved. So now let's tackle the long-term question. Will my headaches go away? My headaches just won't go away, but will they? So obviously when you are diagnosed, your doctor will say your headaches, your migraines are there to stay with you for life. And of course that is true. Like migraines are not something that just extinguishes out and there is no known cure for it. However, there is in the migraine world, there is two terms that you may have heard or maybe will know about today called partial remission and full remission. So a partial remission is a type of migraine relief where you don't get as many attacks as you used to. For example, let's say you're somebody who suffers migraines and you get about 15 attacks a month. And then as time goes on, months go by and you start realizing that you don't have that many severe attacks anymore. So let's say you have 10 now or maybe seven or less. That will be considered a partial remission of migraine relief. And then the other term, the full remission, that's when your migraines go away up to a year. You don't have any attacks of migraines up to a year. So that is a terminology that exists in the migraine world. So don't think that your migraines are gonna stay with you forever or at least in that particular severity and intensity of pain forever. Now there are things that those do affect your migraine remissions and age is one factor, but also the big factors that we tackle as naturopathic doctors, which are your lifestyle modifications, choices, which include diet, sleep, and even stress management. 
and they do make a difference. Many migraine uh, sufferers do say that stress management makes a huge difference in their severities. So part of our tenets, which is our philosophies of naturopathic medicine is to teach, teach you to be your own advocate, to kind of know your patterns, your habits, and have a recollection and memory of all of your migraine attacks and how they have either improved or worsened over the, over the years or so. And, you know, the prevention component of naturopathic medicine, which your doctor will also have mentioned you, is to keep a journal, your migraine journal. But in our case, we also want to keep in mind besides just your migraine attacks, also what were you doing those days? What are those days of high stress? What are those days of weather changes maybe? Or diet, something that you did different in your diet. So those are things that we do wanna keep in mind as well. And again, after all of this, you do wanna be your best advocate. After all, you are your best advocate. And with that, wouldn't you wanna help others be their best advocate as well with migraines? Thankfully, we have a community where we can simply share our experiences online and help each other. And that's what we are trying to achieve as well in the naturopathic world. So I hope this video was informative. Please consider giving it a like or a follow or a subscription and more coming up soon. Have a good day.